couldn't help it. I wanted to dig up a potato and see if I had any potatoes. My plants aren't dying off a whole lot yet. They are starting to get a little yellow and what have you around the bottom. This is in the patch by my house. They actually look better over here. They look a little worse in my big patch. But I just couldn't wait. And I thought, you know what? I'm just gonna dig up this corner one and just see. It's not a big batch, but look what I have. I have two beautiful little Yukon potatoes right here. They're absolutely beautiful. So that means I at least know I have potatoes. I'm hoping some of these have five or six in them, but for right now, I'm extremely excited about these. I wanted to get me a little potato pitchfork looking shovel to harvest these, but I went to the store the other day and they didn't have any like I wanted. I kind of just wanted something that kind of looked like that at the bottom that I could just kind of get up under the potatoes and kind of pull them and let them come up, but they didn't have them. They had these. It's kind of unusual. I've never seen them before, but they were the same price. So I just went ahead and got one, but I like it. You actually can hold this up here however you want. And then you can put your foot on that part and push down on it to shovel in. So it gives you a little leverage to push down on it. And I used that to harvest these potatoes a while ago. But you know, I was at the bed over by my house it wouldn't be a good test if I didn't go ahead and dig a couple from this bed over here. These look worse over here, which means better actually, because as they die off, they're gonna look worse, but that means your potatoes are getting more ready. So I might pick this one here, or I might pick one of these two that are looking like they're really starting to fall over and die. The rest of these, <laughs> some of them look pretty good. It may be another week to two weeks before I fully harvest all of these things over here, but just for tonight, just for tonight, I'm gonna do one plant over here too. I just wanna see what's what. I wanna see what's down there. I got three small potatoes from that little plant. But y'all, I'm happy with these little potatoes. <laughs> y'all, I'm pretty happy with my harvest. It's not huge. Can't move my hand too much or they'll all fall off. It's not huge, but it's something. I've got five little potatoes here. Two of them are pretty good size. The other three are kind of small. But I did harvest off of these end cap pieces and those sometimes those on the end a lot of your healing kind of gets knocked off because of the rain because they're at the end of the rows both of these plants that i pulled up weren't really rooted that deep i've got a lot more hills that are a lot more deep and i think have a lot more potatoes under them than these two little end ones i picked out but it doesn't really matter i'm having fun i know there's potatoes there now <laughs> i know i'm not just growing really big good looking potato plants i know there's potatoes so I'm excited about that. And um, I'm gonna take these in, probably do something with them, have them tomorrow. This year, I'm kind of making a little effort. I'm just gonna eat a lot of fresh things. I'm gonna eat a lot fresh. I'm not too worried about canning right now. I'm gonna just see how much we can stretch our grocery budget and eat fresh out of our garden as much as we can. Coming to you from the potato patch. This is Laney at Hilltop Home Place. Y'all have a great day. Bye-bye.